Congratulations! Oh, so much fun. It goes so fast, you know, when you look forward to these things. It's only an hour, which is short to play for us, and it's just like, oh, <laughs> it's all done. And a lot of things to put on, right? Like all your story, not all your story, but the story you want to tell in one hour. Yeah, yeah exactly. But um, we enjoyed it, you know, and hopefully the crowd enjoyed it too. So, oh. amazing audience. I have to translate, esqueci. <risos> é, bom, falamos, ai, ah, muito bom, muito legal. Ela, obviamente, está com uma energia muito boa. Ela sorri com os olhos, né? Falou <risos> que a, o público estava com uma energia muito boa também. E que uma hora, realmente, é difícil de concentrar, escolher esse set list e poder se apresentar. Assim, acaba ficando curto, né? Quando a gente aquece, já é o tempo de acabar. Se você pudesse colocar em palavras, como você disse antes do seu concerto, que você trabalha como um canal e você sente as energias das pessoas. Energy. What words would you say for the energy you found today? Um, I thought it was just electric, you know, I just felt like people were so buzzed just to be at the festival and really wanting to enjoy themselves and have a good time and that's really what I felt, yeah. Cool, I just have to translate also. Okay. <laughs> Bom, antes do show ela comentou que gosta de funcionar como um canal e sentir a energia que as pessoas estão e devolver essa energia no palco. Perguntei para ela em que palavras ela descreveria a energia que ela encontrou na galera hoje, ela falou que a galera Está muito cheia de energia, feliz de estar ali na frente do palco, porque essa energia chegou, com certeza, em cima do palco. Uh, the last time you were performing here in 2019, I heard that you got a gift, uh, a flag, a Brazil flag, and that it's hanging on your studio, is that true? Yes, it is. We got a flag when we're on stage in Sao Paulo, and I put it in the studio, and so every time I'm there and I'm writing or recording, I think of Brazil, and I think of, you know, what could take us there, what could take us back, and I think of the people and the kindness. We would take you back anytime. <risos> é, eu tenho uma história de que ela ganhou uma bandeira do Brasil quando ela veio para cá em 2019 se apresentar e aí de que essa bandeira fica pendurada no estúdio dela e que ela olha para ela o tempo todo para se inspirar, enfim, lembrar das pessoas. Ela disse que é verdade que ela está o tempo todo lembrando do Brasil, das pessoas aqui, da bondade das pessoas e tentando se conectar com isso enquanto ela está produzindo e compondo música. And we read on one of your interviews that you are very into Brazilian music. Uh, and that you were curious about Gloria Groove that played just before you yes. were on the stage. Could you, did you have the chance to take a look? Yes, I didn't get to take a look, I got to listen. Yeah. So the sound of it was amazing, but my band were there and they were saying there was amazing outfits, amazing dancers. The outfit, the dancers had a little cut out heart. Oh. <laughs> and it was really fun. I was saying to our guitarist, have you had some inspiration now <laughs> for your clothes? <laughs> Cool, cool. Então, eu falei para ela que eu sei que ela gosta muito de música brasileira e ela tinha mencionado em uma entrevista que estava curiosa para conhecer o trabalho da Gloria Groove, que ela já tinha ouvido falar muito bem. Perguntei se ela teve a chance de dar uma olhadinha no show. Ela falou que olhar de fato nem tanto, mas que conseguiu ouvir e que curtiu bastante, que já se tornou aí uma nova referência na música brasileira. So we as Brazilians would like to invite you to move here forever. <laughs> I would love that. You know, it's such an amazing country and the geography is so different to the UK and um, the people. You know, we were out uh, the night before last at Bungalow and we just listened to Samba and there's six people and everybody knew the songs, you know, it's like young, old. Um, it was just beautiful to see people putting down the knives and forks and just getting up and dancing. Yeah, that was a beautiful spirit. That was Rio, here in Rio? Here in Rio, yes, yeah. Falei que ela pode se mandar para o Brasil e nós, como brasileiros, estamos convocando oficialmente. Ela falou, cara, é muito louco, a geografia daqui é muito diferente é, do Reino Unido, né? E que nesses últimos dias eles estavam num bangalô, ouvindo samba, e é, todo mundo cantava, pessoas mais velhas, pessoas mais novas, que tem uma coisa de uma unidade, assim, de colocar os garfos na mesa depois do almoço, cantar, bem brasilidade, né? And in addition to your own songs you perform tonight, uh, Is This Love from Bob Marley that you have already recorded. I'm curious about your relation with Bob's work, you know, how does that influence your work? Um, Bob's been a massive influence on me, you know, the star Put Your Records On has a three little birds. Yeah, yeah, yeah. From Mr. <laughs> and, you know, told me I don't need to worry, it's like don't worry about a thing. I feel like it's been a big influence on just um, the peace and love aspect of his music that Music can go across all boundaries, all different types of people, all countries, all ages, um, and unify people. That's a strong message of his. Yeah, cool. One love, one heart. <laughs> Bom, perguntei para ela sobre a influência dela de Bob Marley, porque hoje, ela, além das músicas dela, ela tocou Is This Love, uma música que ela já gravou. Ela falou que a influência do Bob Marley no trabalho dela é total, tanto que em Put Your Hack Records On, ela faz uma referência a Three Little Birds, né? Three Little Birds sat on my window, and they said that I don't need to worry. This is totally Bob Marley. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. 
<laughs> are you gonna stay now that the job is done? Are you gonna stay, hang out, and maybe yeah, check out Jesse? Yeah, we're gonna hang out. And we were here earlier. We've been to Curitiba on the store. We've been yeah. to Belo Horizonte and São Paulo. So we are very grateful that the festival brought us here, and then we were able to be in some different cities. I've never played in um, Curitiba, Belo Horizonte, and just build a connection there. You know, and hopefully next time be more and more and more. Your pronunciation is great for oh, Portuguese. I was practicing. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know much else, you know, so that's, I'll, I'll improve. But <laughs> those two words are like Curitiba. That's pretty hard. Yeah. Belo Horizonte, it's hard. Yeah. But you, you, you killed it. <laughs> Eu perguntei se ela vai ficar para curtir um pouco do festival, agora que o trabalho está entregue. E ela falou que eles conseguiram vir um pouco antes, né, por conta do Rock in Rio, vir para o Brasil e se apresentaram em Curitiba, em Belo Horizonte, em São Paulo. Uma pronúncia incrível para quem não fala português, tá, querida? Thank you so much, Corinne. Congratulations for your really concert. Really nice to touch you both. Thanks for your energy. It's Thank you for yours. It's very contagious. Contagious. I don't know this word. No, this is good. Contagious. Contagious. Yeah. And yes. so is yours. Oh. And I like your outfits. Thank and we you love so yours. much. Sequins. Yeah. Well, have a great night. You Thank too. You. Thank you. Too. you. Last, last time I interviewed you, I finished saying, Girl, put your records on. Tell me your favorite song. You go ahead, let your head down. Beautiful, yes. thank you so much. Yes, yes. thank you. Oh Rock in Rio ao vivo é só no Multishow e no canal BIS. Tudo nosso de novo. Yeah.